Hey guys, what's up? In this video, we are going to learn how to insert figures in a latex document. So, the first thing that we are going to do is that we need to copy. Uh, we need to copy the, the figure that we are going to insert in the document into the folder where we have the text file. Like here, uh, I'm using article 1.txt file and I copy this figure or image quick learning 3.png so now I'm going to write the simple code for this to call this uh, quick learning 3.png so here as you can see here is the example that I I already wrote here so to insert the figure first we need a package that is called use package graphics x and okay this one is for hyper referencing so we just need this fi this package graphics x so it starts with the begin figure h is for here it means that this figure will exactly appear after the in this section like for example section 1 so this figure will appear so this is section 1 so this figure will exactly appear after this section you can also put T or B T is for top B is for bottom and H is for here so let's keep it H the next is centering the centering is used to keep this figure in the center of the document include graphics width is equal to column width quick learning dot png okay so this is the file and this is the command include graphics to include this figure in this document this is the size width is equal to the width of this figure is equal to, to column width so it means that the width of this figure will be equal to the width of the column this is the caption this is used for slash caption is used for inserting the captions and this is the label that we can use for referencing this figure I will show you later in this video how to reference this figure in the text like as you can see in figure 1 and then you reference figure 1 so this is the first style to insert the figure let's see the second style how to insert the figure okay let's run this okay here it is so in here again this is used for here this command is used for here top bottom of the figure here we just scale the original figure this figure to 50 percent so if you want to use the size of the original as a 50 percent so then you can just write scale 0.5 so it will scale it to 50 percent in the next example let's see the next example let's uncomment this okay so again the rest of the code is the same this is the caption label centering include graphics but here we want to keep the word 70 millimeters so you can it, it's you can give uh, any uh, width for a figure according to your needs if you run it you see we get a width of 70 70 millimeter of the same figure let's see another example on command this so here as we can see the rest of the code is the same begin figure centering include graphics here we are using a vert is equal to text vert so in the first one we use the column vert and here we are using the text vert so if you run this it gives this sorry this is the point 0.3 if we can if we let's increase this to 0.75 so it will give this figure 
so again you can change the width according to your text width here the text width is a single column so is 0.75 of the width of the text let's see another example So let's run this. Okay, this is very important. So if we want to give a more custom options for width and height, we can we can include like width is equal to whatever your desired figure is and height is equal to let's say if we give here 3 and height is equal to six centimeter run it so let's see this figure as you can see the width the width is three and the height is six if we increase this so let's say six by six so this is six by six so these are the diff these were the different methods um, of uh, inserting figures in the text text document in the next video, uh, I will show you how to insert multiple or sub figures in a text document. So again, let's revise this. So the first uh, we use the simple width is equal to column width and the next one we just scale the original picture to a 50 person. In this one, we use the width in uh, 70 millimeter we give we give a scale in the next one in this one we use the figure or the image to the text width and 0.75 so it's 0.75 of the text width in the next one which is very important we give a custom height and a custom width so here we have set the width to 6 centimeter and the height to 6 centimeter you can change this according to your need so i hope you guys like this video if you have any question please leave a comment thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe bye